Hey, this is Dan from Drone Deploy. Today we're going to be going over how you can submit an app for approval. After you've worked on an app, you can find it inside the installed section of the apps tab. You can click in and click edit. And once you've done that, make sure to give your app all the information it needs. All right, along with the description. Now you'll notice here, this is the description users will see before they click in on your app. In addition, you should upload a logo and some detail images to give users a better idea of what your app's about. And finally, once you've done that, you should label which permissions or which APIs your app uses. This will let nos users know what functionality you're going to access, what personal information they have. Finally, when you're good with that, click deploy for mobile testing. Now what this does is currently your app will only work inside the browser you're working with it on. And once you click deploy for mobile testing, now you're able to open up your phone or Safari or different browsers and test to see if everything is still working as you expect. If it's not, you can come back and create a new version of your app push it back through to the testing phase and try it again. Once everything's good and you're happy with it, you can click submit for approval. And what that has done is that has now sent us a message to say, we should review your app and see if it's ready to be put on the store. Um, <clears throat> our, our goal is to review apps within two days, but if you have any questions about the approval process or what will make your app more likely to be approved, please visit our forum at forum.dronedeploy.com.